Let's look at Deer & Company stock and see if it's worth owning today. We will cover all these points for better stock picking. Deer & Company closed at $409.52, with the decrease of negative 0.17% in the last trading session. Let's look at today's trend indicators. The moving average is bearish. Technical indication is in downtrend and overall daily trend for the stock is in very declining trend. Looking at weekly analysis, the weekly stock trend is in positive trend. Today's market fear in greed index is 79, which is indicating extremely greedy emotion in the public sentiment. We usually look at this indicator to make our buy or sell decisions better. Deer and Company gave negative 3.15% returns in the last week negative 3.97% in the last 30 days, and three months returns are 2.70%. Now let's have a look at simple moving average data. Moving average indicates that, what could be the next footprint of the stock price in near future? Five-day average is 411 with a bearish indication. 10-day is 415 with a bearish indication. 20-day average is 420 which is a bearish signal. Let's look at fundamental analysis. We will mainly see the last two quarters of the company. In June 22, the revenue was $14,102 million. In the recent quarter, September 22, it increased to $15,536 million. Now let's see the profitability of Deer and Company. In the quarter June 22, the profits were $1,884 million. And in the recent quarter, September 22, the profits increased to $2,246 million. Let's see debt numbers. Debt to equity number tells us how much the company is in debt. In the first quarter, it was 2.66, then it decreased to 2.58, then in third quarter, it again went up to 2.69. In the recent quarter, the debt score declined to 2.56. Generally, this ratio should not be over 2.0. To see today's buy or sell decision of the stock, we will use the buy sell indicator web page. Just press the analyze button on the page and it will calculate all indicators and display today's buy or sell decision for this stock. I am putting up the link in the description box. Please help yourself.